Mosquitoes are small insects. They have two wings and six legs. Despite their tiny size, they play a huge role in the ecosystem. But don't let their size fool you. These little creatures are more than just a nuisance. These creatures are considered the most dangerous animals on Earth. Their bite can transmit serious diseases. Why? Because they spread deadly diseases. Malaria, dengue, Zika, and West Nile virus are just a few examples. These diseases can make people very sick. Symptoms can range from mild discomfort to severe illness. And sadly, they can even kill. Every year, millions of people are affected. Mosquitoes thrive in warm climates. They are especially active during the warmer months. They need stagnant water to lay their eggs. This is where their larvae develop. This makes tropical and subtropical regions particularly vulnerable to mosquito-borne illnesses. The warm, humid environment is ideal for their breeding. But mosquitoes can be found all over the world. From urban cities to rural areas, they are everywhere. They are a global threat to human health. Efforts to control their population are crucial in preventing disease outbreaks. Mosquitoes don't just give you itchy bites, they can transmit serious diseases. One of the deadliest is malaria. Malaria causes fever, chills, and flu-like symptoms. It can be fatal, especially for young children. Another dangerous disease is dengue fever. Dengue causes high fever, severe headaches, and joint pain. In severe cases, it can lead to internal bleeding and death. The Zika virus is another threat. It can cause birth defects in babies if pregnant women are infected. Mosquitoes have a devastating impact on human health. Millions of people get sick from mosquito-borne diseases every year. Hundreds of thousands of people, mostly children in developing countries, die from these diseases annually. These diseases not only cause suffering and death, they also put a strain on healthcare systems. The cost of treating these diseases is a huge burden for many countries. It hinders economic development and perpetuates poverty. Section 4. Fighting Back, Mosquito Control and Disease Prevention. The good news is that we are not powerless against mosquitoes. We have several strategies at our disposal to combat these pests. There are effective ways to control their populations and prevent the diseases they spread. These methods are both practical and scientifically proven. One important tool is insecticide-treated bed nets. These nets are designed to provide a protective barrier against mosquito bites. These nets protect people from mosquito bites while they sleep, significantly reducing the risk of mosquito-borne diseases. Indoor residual spraying is another method. This technique involves applying insecticides to the interior walls of homes. This involves spraying insecticides on the walls of homes, creating a lethal barrier for mosquitoes. This kills mosquitoes that land on the walls, effectively reducing their numbers indoors. Eliminating breeding sites is also crucial. Mosquitoes lay their eggs in standing water so removing these sites can prevent new generations from emerging. We can do this by removing standing water around our homes. Simple actions like emptying containers, unclogging gutters and covering water storage can make a big difference in mosquito control. Section 5. Our Shared Responsibility – Understanding and Combating the Threat Mosquitoes and the diseases they carry are a serious global health challenge. These tiny insects are responsible for transmitting deadly diseases like malaria, dengue, and Zika, affecting millions of people worldwide. It is crucial that we all understand the risks and take steps to protect ourselves and our communities. Using mosquito repellents, wearing protective clothing, and ensuring our homes are mosquito-proof are just a few ways we can safeguard our health. We can support research into new and better ways to control mosquitoes and prevent diseases. Scientists are working tirelessly to develop innovative solutions, from genetic modifications to advanced trapping techniques. We can also educate others about the importance of mosquito control. Community awareness programs and educational campaigns play a vital role in spreading knowledge and encouraging proactive measures. By working together, we can reduce the burden of these diseases and save lives. Community cleanup drives to eliminate stagnant water and breeding grounds are essential in our fight against mosquitoes. Remember, even small actions can make a big difference. Simple steps like disposing of stagnant water and maintaining cleanliness in our surroundings can significantly reduce mosquito populations and the risk of disease.